Hey everybody, it's The Doll Circle, and today's another episode of what to wear with the dolls. And with the dolls today that I'm doing is going to be the Bratz dolls, because of course there's been so many new Bratz coming out recently. I've been going Bratz crazy, so Bratz everywhere. And I wanted to know what other clothes can fit on them, because I've never owned Bratz before besides these new uh, doll lines. I did own some of the Bratzilla dolls, and I have those out here today too to compare with you guys. So in front of us here, I've got two new Jade dolls, and I've got one of the Chloe dolls, which I keep calling Cleo, but I know it's Chloe, so... I, I had to keep reminding her. I have to fix that. I I'm like, so Chloe. sorry. Chloe. I'm so used to Cleo from Monster High. I'm sorry. Okay, so today I have them in, two of them in Monster High outfits and one in an Ever After High outfit, and as you can see, it fits almost perfectly. It, like, blew my mind when I put this on there. I was like, oh, I have so much more for them to wear now, because Bratz is releasing fashion packs where you can get, like, two outfits together. Um, those are currently out at Target, and then they also have single packs that aren't out, which there's a couple that I have to get. Um, but with these, like, the Monster High outfits, as you can see here, I'm going to move these girls. Hopefully they can balance. Okay. As you can see, they actually fit really well in the waistline and the bust. The hips are a little snug, actually, but it still looks good. Now, the halter here, this one is a halter top, so it does fit better than if it had actual sleeves. The only problem with this, the sleeves don't fit just right on them. I had an Ever After High jacket somewhere. I thought I set it up here, but I guess he didn't. And it just doesn't fit right on the shoulders that well. So if it's something that's a halter or a strapless, it will fit on the new Bratz dolls. I don't have any old Bratz dolls, so I can't really compare with them, so I apologize. If I do buy one, I'll try to give you guys like an update or something on that. And this is a Draculaura dress. This is one of my favorite dresses. So you'll probably see this dress a lot in the What to Wears. Just to give you guys a comparison, like exactly what it looks like in multiple dolls, instead of just using different dresses. And then the shoes I took off of this doll and put it with this doll because it would match her outfit a little bit better. This is from the uh, sleepover party line. Yeah, sleepover um, line that's available at Walmart. And with Chloe, not Cleo, because <laughs> I'm going to do it wrong again. This is from the selfie snap line, and she's wearing Holly's outfit from Ever After High. So as you can see, it's super stretchy material, so it makes it easier to fit, and the length looks okay. I don't have a lot of extra shoes, as you can tell. I just have a few of the shoes that come with the Bratz already, um, for the ones I've purchased. So she's actually just wearing the original shoes, just because they're light pink. Now they are also releasing two packs of shoes, like a pack that has two pairs of shoes in them, for $6.99 at Target. I actually filmed it in my last toy hunt video, if you guys want to check back and see what they look like. I didn't buy any, I regret it. <laughs> I'm actually gonna go back and probably buy a pack or two just so they have more shoes. But as you can see here, I'll show you the back as well. It fits, I mean, it gives her a really good clean line. Like I really, really, really like it. I thought it looked really good. So that's why I chose this outfit for her and it also kind of matched her hair. And then this one, oh my gosh. This jade is still my favorite. I've bought, uh, bought, I've bought, <laughs> Ooh, proper English. Um, a lot of the different Bratz dolls so far, and I love Jade. She's so far my probably my favorite character. My second one would be definitely her. Um, I don't know. She just blows me away. I love the shaved head. I love how striking it is. So I decided I was trying to figure out what shoes to give her because I had these slipper shoes that came with the sleepover doll, and I was like, okay, slippers that won't go with a swimsuit. That won't go with a fashion gown. So then I thought maybe if I hide her foot completely, it would work, and it does. This is Caddy's, the first Caddy from Monster High Boots, I just pushed it on her foot and it actually doesn't look that bad. It makes her actually look to me more proportioned because she doesn't have the oversized feet and as you can see from the dress, it looks glamorous and then I was thinking, hey, you know, the dresses fit on the waistline and she's like, oh, you don't have any stands up but then I'm like, oh, I'm trying to think, I'm like, man, what, do I, what am I going to do? I figured, I'm like, wait, if the dress fits, the stand should fit and this is actually a Monster High stand. So even though these dolls don't come with stands, you guys can use the Monster High stands. And you can probably buy them, you know, if you guys buy them on eBay or whatever, they're a little bit cheaper. Or if you guys have spare ones from other dolls that you don't play with anymore, good option. Like, I'm really so happy right now that I decided to, like, sit here for, like, a couple hours and just play with them. Because this looks so good. I love how it looks on her. And I love how the dress came out and the boots. And if you guys are wondering what it looks like, I'm going to show you guys. See, because they have normally just the pegs. And since, obviously, like... She needs to have a shoe on. You just slip this right on. So if you have any other Monster High boots that are fully covered, it works. Now I'll show you a couple other shoes that I have here. Obviously, since she just has a peg, you can't wear open toe shoes. That doesn't work. <laughs> so what I have here instead is, um, for example, like Holly's shoe. And I will put it on Chloe's foot. It looks weird, but in a picture from far away, you couldn't tell. So see if you just slip it over that, 
Here, I'll actually do both so it doesn't look so weird. Because <laughs> I'll admit, it does look a little a little weird here. Um, where's Tyler's shoe? There it is. And these are Holly's shoes, too. Okay, it makes her super short, I'm warning you guys, but it doesn't look terrible. I don't know, what do you think? It looks terrible, doesn't it? It looks a little weird. It looks a little weird because it looks like she doesn't have any ankles. Yeah. <laughs> but... Again, from super far away, like, like, okay, don't it could, it. And it, could also, it could also be, like, the dress, too. Okay, maybe the dress makes it look a little weird. Oh, yeah, you're kind of right. It does look a little weird. Maybe the dress wasn't so long. Yeah, like, here, how about that? That looks... Not, a... not as bad. No, but boots, we're going to have to stick with boots on yeah, this. Yeah, boots. Boots. Okay, experiment gone wrong. Figured I'd try it. Why not? Okay, it's like so Scarrow's here. boots. Oh. Uh, See, I grabbed here an Ever After High boot, but see, one problem with Ever After High, their legs are thicker, and look, the boot doesn't fit. They look like, um, Looks mud weird. walkers. Like swamp boots. <laughs> I was like, I'm like, what's a mud walker? Is that like a new fashion thing I don't know about? <laughs> That's why I don't know about it. It's a swamp boot. Okay. So here, let's try out, if I can get, oh my gosh. Okay, now, okay, that was really tight. So this is Scara's boots, so let's see what foot is that. That's the right foot. Okay, I don't like that. Do you want to see it? It looks weird, doesn't it? I mean, it doesn't look terrible. Okay, so what I'm learning now, the only one that looks good is Caddy's boots. I was completely wrong. I was like, oh, just put on a new Monster High boot. It looks great. Maybe it's just Caddy's boots look really good with this outfit and this doll. I don't know. I kind of want to try some more experiments because I love popping, um, exchanging their heads with bodies and stuff like that. Like, I put a lot of Ever After High heads on the Barbie, uh, style uh, bodies ever after high head barbie style bodies okay that makes sense um and i've done that just because i like the articulation and the head actually looks really good on that body shape so i may actually try doing that like popping off a brat's head and putting it on a barbie body if you guys have done that at home and know that it doesn't work let me know so i don't ruin a doll or two <laughs> but i think it looks out really cool though i love how like the dresses just fit them so well here i'll just pop her back up so you can see it i just love how it looks and i'm so happy that the outfits fit now i have tried other outfits here's a barbie top way too big way too much room so that's not gonna work but again with the ever after high stuff like you can put the swimsuits on there and this swimsuit i had on here earlier looked really good the problem is i don't have any the thing i don't like about the brats if you guys know they're gonna make bare feet like just their foot without any shoe on them then I feel like the swimsuits would look good so if they are gonna make that let me know and someone also commented on an old video that the old brats feet don't fit on the new bodies if that's true let me know before I decide to go out and buy some stuff because <laughs> I would like to buy more accessories for them so I hope this guys I hope this helps you out a little bit when it comes to if you're maybe afraid to buy some of the new brats dolls like oh well if I buy that doll I'm gonna have to buy all new shoes and all new outfits well, at least you have options now. You can wear your monster high dresses. You can wear your ever after high dresses, and you can even wear the boots. Evidently, just caddies. I don't know. And what about the Daiso ones? More. Like, if they fit a monster high, you think they'd be able to fit oh, them yeah, they too? They probably do. I don't have any more spare ones. They're all being worn right now. But if you guys watched my last what to wear, I took um, Holly and Poppy O'Hare, and I put them in Daiso outfits from the Daiso store, and those actually looked good too. So anything that's in a more petite fashion may work so if you guys have any other like slimmer dolls like this it might work as well so let me know comment below i know i went over a lot again let me know if this helped you guys out on this what to wear episode i know it helped me out sitting here and playing with this i absolutely loved it and I'm, they look so good <laughs> as always make sure to subscribe and check us out um we do videos every single day and i'm going so brats crazy expect more brats videos in the future and make sure to check out our facebook instagram and twitter thanks guys